Thanks, Welcome back to part 26. Is anyone this there? shaft that it prompted us to go Here to. That was where the. Reset. Uh, Turn it. Let us be free. Next to core. Okay, so that's main domain. Anyways, uh, this little shaft that is prompting us to go to, that's, that's all we needed to do and keep walking ahead. Um, we're kind of bummed out that I didn't figure that out in the last episode. But here we are. We're going to finish this mission up, I think. That thing is so fast. Uh, find element four. Okay. Don't hit that button. What? He's narrow-minded, won't ever understand the truth and set him free. I think he might know what's best for himself. Could be risking a lot. Could lose a lot. Or by liberating his bits, could become more than a lipstick-wearing butler on wheels. And what if it really is a virus? And what if you're about to snuff out some sentient beings? See something of yourself in him, oh. don't you? Gonna murder a cab driver's kids because he asked you nicely, and he's always been a good guy. Well, I mean, when you put I gotta it like do that, something. If you don't want to free him, at least don't delete him. Slip him into Dell's code. Just merge him in his offshoot. Don't know how to do that. Then don't hit that fucking button. Destroy the core. Hey. Oh, we can't. We can't. Yeah, I've only got one. We can't force personalities to merge. Reset. I mean, whatever. Fuck yeah. Nice. Doming! Can you hear me? Doubt he can anymore. Okay. All right. Try to. It is done. We're free at last. The time of war is defeated. Thank you for helping us. Help you help us all. Poor kiddos, thirsty for freedom, oblivious about the city's dark side. So you think? Delmin. I think for some reason, one car's left in the garage. I'm going crazy. Hello. Can you hear me? Get in, please. Sounds like. The original Delamain. Your V, right? Yeah. Um, well, I know that one thing then. What happened to Delamain? He no longer exists. I am now uh, attempting to comprehend what remains of him. And who are you? Uh, good question. Does the name Excelsior mean anything? Comprehensive insurance, combat mode, funeral services. Quite right. It seems that even in the face of annihilation, the Delamain network is not abandoning its Excelsior program clients. Father's last will was to give me life so that I may uh, offer my services to you. I intend to do just that, just as soon as I learn to drive. What do I call you? Excelsior, as I was called before. Now drive, V. The road awaits. Did we just get a Delamain cab? Father would be proud of us. I think to be bulletproof. I'm kind of confused. You need a new kidney? And then stall yours now at Milton Nelman. Okay, well, 
that's what we did with Delamain. Oh, River Ward, I forgot about him. Morales. I mean, Judy? We got Safan, we gotta meet with Takamura again. There's a lot to do. Okay. Could be a fast travel point somewhere around here, right? Oh, look at that car. Good thing. Could be a fast travel point. Ooh, that was so close. Maybe I'm wrong. I guess we have to take the, the car. Whatever. Let's just get it going, huh? How about this? We'll see what time it is. Yeah. About 10 p.m., so this should be evening enough. get a feel for the layout of the city by driving around like this. I know like in between our episodes I'll just kind of bum around Night City and sell stuff or craft stuff or change clothes. And it's really cool to watch Edge Runners and it's the exact thing. I love how they did that. You know because some shows are like their own interpretation or whatever. That's very cool that it's all I don't know what any of those are. Dude, Delamain is so weird. Oh, we got another race? I think that's why Claire texted us. I have tried so hard not to go into any spoilers and look at anything to do with cyberpunk. So, but I'm, I have a feeling that this is going to be one of those games where you like can't get out of whatever's happening to you. And it's going to be like one of those tragic games, kind of like Red Dead Redemption 2. You, you have to meet your demise. So I'm keeping that in mind. That's why I'm doing all these hey, side hey, missions. And come stuff. on in. Pizza's getting cold. Now, why we're here? Let's help people. Why we're here? Let's make an impact for. We're in I'm the sure it's gonna be because I did hear that they were gonna develop cyberpunk. You made it. Good. Grab a seat. This is Roxanne. She's worked at Clouds longer than any of us. Hello. Uh, hey, nice to meet you. When I heard what you pulled at Clouds, shit, I so regretted I was off that day. Just eat the free pizza and then we're out of here, okay? There it is. Who cares what Johnny thinks? Feeling better? You look better? 
I'm on autopilot. I don't think. Just do. That's Sound good, good, Judy. Do I have to keep talking to these people? So then, what's the plan? Need to wait for Michael. That would be her. You'll never get rid of the stench of the corpse. You drop a lot of them, don't you? What's your secret? So what's this plan all about? I'd like to hear the answer to that too. I modified the behavioral chip. It can equip any doll with a motor reflex system. In other words, make the doll move and fight like a preem tier That's what I solo. thought when it said the uh, reflex. Fascinating, isn't it? What one can learn while so tuning fake orgasms for the moxes. Mind stepping outside? Can't smoke in here. You'll air it out later. Dude, this trick's a bitch. Fine, I'll sit by the window. The body will react as if executing a well-trained series of movements. Already tested it out on Tom. Chip's impulses supplant any natural reflexes, so it'll make users feel like they're experiencing cyberpsychosis. But it's basically the same as when we activate ourselves for a client. Solo skills don't lie in just executing movements. There are split-second processes that happen. Logistics, decision-making, result of years of practice. Doubt your chip's capable of compensating for that. You're probably right, but I don't see another way. Alternatives intensive training, but we don't have time for that. Uh, reflexes need to be a 10. We do have one. We can make it happen. Tech that's all pros and no cons. I don't buy it. Side effects, spill them. Combat mode auto-initiates when a threat is present, and uh, there's no way to stop it. Can't find a workaround. And that's it? I don't know. Only way to determine that would be through months of testing on a range of subjects. There's an ethical side, too. You can murder someone and not remember a thing. Alright. Gotta see it to believe it. Finally, someone We're said fight it. Tom? Tom? Pulled that sequence from a kung fu training virtue. Why is he getting a knife though? Convinced. If I'm gonna count on ninja dolls, I'm gonna need to see some real action. Like, wanna spar? What else? Okay. Just don't mess up my digs, okay? I like it here. It's on now! <gasps> what the? Oh shit. Everything chill? You okay? Look at me go! You see that? Woo! I've got to Gotta do say. some cardio! Just say it. Who, me? This is my impressed face. <laughs> nice work, Judy. I did yourself. If you were to sell that, be the richest Judy in the NUSA. Please. Plenty of killing machines in the world. I don't want to turn more people into them. After this, chips are getting micro nuked. <sighs> okay. Probably so she didn't it. have an army, so the she's making one. But what about Let's the monsters? Let's get to it then. You've got like an elite force of three muscle heads were... and a techie. The bouncers what or whatever. First time we went to Lizzie's. Guards and Why not get them? In and around will overpower. Take down, disarm, escort them out. Clouds will be ours. Bosses, we'll give an ultimatum. A cut of the proceeds in exchange for never showing their faces at the club again. And having no say in how the club's managed. That's what I thought. A half-baked, insane plan. You can't see more than an inch ahead of you. Taking out the security there won't solve anything. Claus will just send more. Hiromi Sato's the man you gotta get to. 
Hiromi Sato? Who's that? Cloud's real boss. He rarely shows, but you can't so much as sneeze without him finding out. Claws trust him, respect his opinion. He is one of them. We can try to convince him, but it's doubtful. We stand a better chance by injecting him with a dose of fear. Where do we okay. find this Hiromi? At his apartment, H8 Mega Tower, topmost floor. It's a penthouse, almost never steps outside its glass walls. But I'll figure out a way to get us inside. This just might work. If we get him in his apartment where he thinks he's completely safe, bosses will understand what we're looking to demonstrate. My, my. There's a flickering in that skull sponge of yours after all. So how about it, V, Tom, Roxy? Made up your minds? I... I need to think about it. Never wasted anyone before, you know. I'm with it all the way. V? Don't tell me you're seriously considering this. Sticking our precious necks out for a bunch of whores. Mm. Count me in, Judy. I already said I'd help, didn't I? Thanks, V. Save the gratitude for later, please. I'll set up the meet with Hiromi and let you know. I need a couple days. Have fun. Toodaloo. Michael, hold up. Give us a lift. Only if you don't talk to me. I feel a migraine coming on. Shit. I'm scared, V. Speaking of gratitude, stuff I'm asking you to do, well, usually comes with a price tag, I know. You want to help, I get that. But I'm more than happy to pay your fee in full. Feels like it's only right. Judy, for real? No. Don't want to hear it. I know last time we spoke to Judy, we... Not a word. ...had one of the decisions and it was like... Yeah, we need paid. I didn't like that, so I'm glad we gotta go back. V, everything okay? V, you don't look so hot. <sighs> okay. Okay, I'm better. Fine. What the hell, V? You, like, sick? Reinforcements call to the attack site. Managed to the assailants. It's past. Forget about it. It's late. You're tired. You can crash on my couch if you want. Sounds great. Thanks. Yeah, he'd be only good if he was Don't worry about right it. Away. Make yourself at home. I know. I'm getting ahead of myself. Didn't know she dabbled in that robotics. Now that's fucking Shimra. Think that's how she winds down? After a day's work of tuning hardcore smut? Wouldn't be surprised. No. Interesting. Place looks like a fucking antique museum. I guess you should feel right at home. Chick's got taste. Except for one thing. And what's that? Way she looks at you. Don't pretend you haven't noticed. Makes you all mushy inside. I can feel it. Don't you think it's a bit too soon for a brain dance like this? Breakfast sandwich. There you go. Oh, well, well. The Bushido collection in BD format. 
First three are collector's items nowadays. Her first novel, Requiem for a Samurai, which was published in 70 languages simultaneously, sold over 3 million copies. In the shade of an apple tree is it a rummaging beauty strip. Um, okay. Nice. Man, she just talking. Might be able to help me. Oh, she thinks I'm joking. Okay. I mean, the uh, Aldecaros are like into tech and. Sorry, sorry. Maybe. There's a maybe. You might have some hope. Damn, Jellamain. Yeah. They gave it to us. From here, what do we have? Um, Carlos. Oh my gosh, there's so much stuff. Nothing up here. We gotta take some of this stuff down. I mean, I guess we could just go check what, check out what this is. Just so we don't miss anything. Well, I have to say, I am really impressed with Night City. It's hard to compete with a studio like Rockstar, but this is the closest I've seen. Like, this is very unique. What is that about? Very unique, a whole lot of fun. I would say a, a second to what Rockstar does, though. Oh, in combat. Can't pass fire on combat.
This must be like one of the <laughs> these, these things. This must be one of the um, split off personalities. Hi, you there, mysterious stranger. You who? Yeah, you. There any other mysterious stranger around here? You know what? How about I tell you a joke? Sure, be my guess. What must all trauma team medics swear to uphold? The hypocritical oath! Okay, what's going on? Hey there, stranger! I'm Brendan, your friendly neighborhood SCSM. And the nicest AI in all of Night City. I don't know you about can that. select from a wide range of beverages, or just drop by for a chat anytime. Now it's your turn. What's your name? Why am I talking to a schism? Uh, my name's V. Pleasure to meet you, V. Do you come here often? Nope, first time here. Wouldn't you know? I could tell you weren't from around here. What with that? homesickness of yours and you know what the best cure for homesickness is a sweet refreshing lightly carbonated beverage okay you've got me i'm sold salt nothing's gonna be sold here because you know what i'm gonna give you a can of night cola for free thanks brendan right <laughs> that's right gosh it's so cool you remembered even for a simple scsm Cool. So did you want something from me? Oh, yes. Well, I do apologize for taking advantage of you at this early stage in our friendship. But could I ask you for a favor? What happened? See that container in front of me? It's completely blocking my view of the street, depriving an SCSM of its greatest pastime. Could you move it a bit to the side? I'll reward you with my undying gratitude. Even though, technically, I don't stock that. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, V. Boy, are you strong. Here, have a refreshing yeah. beverage. On me. This whole nice act of yours is just way too much. That's just how I was programmed. You think anybody'd interact with a grumpy, spontaneous, craving satisfaction machine? Exactly. Would you even be able to offend me? Ooh, come on, Sam a whore. Why would I want to do that? You just saved me. All right, can't force you. It's your choice, after all, isn't it? If you call triggering an obscenity conversion subroutine a choice, then you're absolutely right. So they programmed you with irony, too. Or are you just being naive? That depends on you. What would you prefer me to be? You know what? Never mind. Catch you later, Brendan. Catch me? Why? Will I be falling? It's just something you say as a way of goodbye. Oh, I get it. I mean, I don't, because catching has nothing to do with goodbyes, but... <laughs> oh well. Don't humans say the darndest things? Catch you later, V. <laughs> what a neat phrase. Okay. These look like tiger paws if I've ever seen them. Yep. What are they dealing with that? This guy, the veteran guards so of 6th Street. Alright, good for you guys. From here. 
Let me do it finally. Let's do the paralysis. I know it's been so long since we've talked with Takamura, but I mean, obviously he's central to the story. So I feel like progressing that is, is going to become a point of no return, right? I mean, the paralysis being like a side quest. Side quest. It's like duty thing, it's kind of side quest group. So cool. Good to see you again. Something happened? Come on. Jeff will explain everything. He's just about done prepping for the debate. I've rescheduled all his meetings out of the office today. The office meeting here, so nobody will bother us. Mike, we're, we're talking about the cornerstone of my exactly. platform. I'm not doing a You'll YouTube just because Nightcore... No, I'm not sucking anyone's dick just so they can fuck me in the ass! <laughs> Look, I gotta go. Make the amendments, we'll powwow later. V, glad you could make it. Jefferson. Grab a seat, please. I'll explain why I asked you to come over. We've had a break-in. Not the usual kind, though. So unusual how? A couple of days back, dead of night, something wakes me. A noise. I grab my pistol and come out of the bedroom. See a stranger. He looks like he's about to reach for it, so I pull the trigger. Nail him? No idea. My head started spinning and I passed out. No trace of him the morning after. Whoa. I'd like you to find him. Find out what he wanted. Notify the badges yet? We don't want any buzz around this. No attention, whatever. You know. NCPD's full of people who like the occasional stray eddy. If we reported a break-in, the media descend on us like a swarm of locusts. No badges. Gotcha. Of course, we notified SSI about the incident. Our private security. SSI's pretty small time. Why didn't you go with Arsaka or Militech? It's what was recommended to us. On the I bright do. side, we're not dependent on any mega corporations. Okay. Obviously want Why me, this. of all people? Wouldn't rather have a detective look into it? Prefer to use tried and tested contacts. Can't blame you. Former mayor's death? You unraveled that mystery. Kinda. I trust you'll be able to crack this one as well. Intruder, take anything? Break anything? Nothing missing. I haven't noticed any damage either. Jeff must have scared him off before he could do anything. Okay. Said you passed out? That's right. Just after I fired. What then? Nothing. Somebody might have clicked I woke him. up in bed the next morning. Maybe a net Killer runner. headache to boot. Any Good idea who you made it back to your bed? Nope. None. Elizabeth's at a loss too. What did the intruder look like? I can't remember much. It was dark. He was wearing some sort of mask. 
Or was it an implant? I couldn't really get a good look at him. Elizabeth didn't see him either. I slept through the whole thing. Election season takes its toll on you. Security look into this? Say anything? This is where things get a little weird. Okay. They claim there's no sign of a break-in or of a shot being fired. What? Security cams didn't record anything. Guard outside didn't see her. Yeah, they ran on it. They bad. suggested Jeff must have had a bad dream. Convenient answer. Liz gave security the day off so I could call you in. This security outfit, SSI. Who are they? Been on the market the last 15 years. They have clients across the city. If memory serves, they came recommended. An acquaintance. You think SSI might be behind this? Well, yeah, who's the acquaintance? That or someone hiding behind SSI. Anyone come to mind readily? Walden Holt? He's my main rival, fighting for the same seat at the table. Holt's poll numbers have been dropping. But it could be anyone, really. Jeff has many enemies, a lot of them powerful. <laughs> we could sit here naming names all day. I see. That's why I called you, V. I need you to find out what the hell's going on. Anything else you want to tell me? Or think maybe you should? Hmm. Nope. That about covered it. Liz? It seems like everything. It's unlikely we'll learn anything anyway. Honey, please. I'm sure V will turn something up. Yeah. So, why doubt, you got all you need for now? Why doubt V? Wouldn't mind taking a look around the apartment? Of course. Liz can give you the tour. Gotta run to a meeting. As soon as you learn anything, let me know. Come on. Let me show you around. Rather poke around my own way. You mind? No, of course not. I'll be right behind you, in case. Okay, okay. Go back inside. Just looking around. Stay with me. Okay, you see the mini map? Everything must be upstairs. Fresh fruit. Tasty, by the looks of it. They deliver it to us. It's included in the rent. Looks like it's been enhanced. What have we got here? Glutamine, noradrenaline, dopamine, serotonin. All neurotransmitters. Know anything about this? It's smart food. It's enhanced for improved mental performance. I don't know if it really works, but people believe it. Other than that, it isn't half bad. Fresh fruit for rotting vegetables. This was my den before the campaign. Oh, wow. Well. Okay. Get started here. That's the only one that really runs off the top, doesn't it? Okay, we could try that though. Second, five, five, bear with me here.
man, there's really no good way to do this. Let's go quick. What does it matter? Okay, sorry. We need a BD and an E9. Yeah, we can do that. A place to focus, relax. Doesn't look good anymore. Security had to set up somewhere. One of the many small sacrifices I've had to make. This was the first, but it won't be the last. Okay. A lot of things it wants me to check out. Blood stains. Not quite scrubbed clean. Where's the blood from? Hey, yours? I'm 100% sure it's not ours. Maybe the intruders? Probably. Why is this door concealed? Where? There's no door here. Where? Scanner's showing something different. Wait. Come in here? Jesus Christ. Think we're safe putting your security at the top of our list of suspects? Yeah, no kidding. They violated our privacy. Sons of bitches! Under my own roof! Weird hardware. What's it for? Connected to the wall-mounted screens. It is. Wonder where else these cables run. How could they do this to us? Alpha is Jefferson. The gull. How could they do this to us? The gull. I don't usually read these, but this is actually kind of interesting. Wow. Ever noticed anything out of the ordinary? Suspicious? That they're violating our trust? Watching our every move? That they'd concealed a goddamn secret room full of spy stuff in our own apartment? No kidding. So you didn't notice, okay? Wonder how long they've been keeping this from you. Too long. I'm not letting any more of those freaks set foot. Oh. Something wrong? Oh. Don't worry about me. Do what you have to do. Something like this back in the war. Transmitters. Militech was using them. Short range UHF. Signal only travels line of sight, but it can't be intercepted. Line of sight? Let's look around. See if we can't spot where our receiver is camping out. Got a vision on our receiver. Black band park next to it. Gotta be our winner. Wow. Transmitters within reach of our mystery van. I wonder if Elizabeth has ever seen the car. Pretty cool views up there.
Oh, the keys. Liz, this is way bigger than we thought. Jeff's entire campaign could be threatened. Let me worry about the race. Just tell me what you managed to find. There's a transmitter on the roof. Seems to be conveying a signal to a van out front. Know who it might be? We never set up any transmitter. And I don't know a thing about any van, but my guess is it's SSI's. Uh, could be. Tech they're using seems unconventional, though. Do you plan to check it? Yeah. Oh well, yeah. About to pay him a personal visit. I'll wait here. Just don't tell Jeff anything for now, okay? Sure, whatever. I'll call him once I know something more substantial. That's fine. Just remember, it's the busiest time for Jeff right now. You can always come and talk to me. That's kind of fine. Suspicious. I'll keep that in mind. She knows. A little bit of something, I think. Take the wheels, V. That van could give us a slip any second. Okay. Just in case it does, we're gonna want to have a easy escape here. I mean, I found it. Is this guy doing? Oh, we gotta follow it. Johnny was in there. Don't lose him, V. Oh, now yeah, you're interested. Plan. We could expose a corpo conspiracy here, V. I'm telling you. They could be Corpo's spies, or who the fuck knows what. I'm very sorry. A lot of weird people in Night City. I was thinking about that, like, even the story of David Martinez, like, just self-destruction, and I haven't found, like, a straight-up good guy in Night City yet. Yo! Okay, get out of that.
camera takes a minute to catch up. You look at politicians and see a curated display, but behind the scenes it's all out war. Citizens don't choose their representatives. Then who? The key players, string pullers. They spy on all the paralysis, look for weak spots, blackmail, wriggle us. Shit. They're taking us into Northside. It's cannon well, Johnny. This is where I found this car, by the way. Northside? North End. I don't remember which one. Just look. Yeah, I found this car in this warehouse. Packed with hardware. My optics don't see any manufacturer info or detect any mods. They don't mass produce trucks like those. What are they doing? What are they hiding? Ear jacking. Huh. Could be the security firm or government. Media scouting for dirt on the paralysis. Sound like he was up here with us, didn't it? Hit this right quick. Hmm, we'll watch that with FF to one C. And one C to BB. Yeah, we try that. FF to one C, proxy it to a BD. Damn, we're gonna have to proxy again. Cause I messed that up. Probably four times. We'll get there eventually. Hazmat suit. Cool. Got something red over there. What's this guy doing? Uh. Deep shot. I think I've pretty much given up on stealth as a whole. I mean, I still don't want to like go on guns blazing. Should probably turn off all the security systems right after this. So FF leads into FF. Okay, one C five five. 1C55 to FF is what we're looking for. It looks. Okay, yep. That looks like the one. And two, right? And we're looking. Nine, nine. This guy right here, too. On the run? Oh, miss him. Oh yeah, let's turn it all off. You're here. I know you are. No, we don't. The fuck. Yeah. 
pierced it, we're in. Couldn't ask the NCPD for better records than this. Pictures, medical records. Vulnerability to neuroplasticity. It's some kind of database. Brain scans, the paralysis biological casts, neuroplasticity. Fuck. What about that? The blue shit. Fresh neural links. They're not spying on them, Johnny. They're fucking with their heads. Yeah. I mean to say someone's literally controlling our upstanding politicians' minds? That's what it looks like. Uh -huh. Red blots are memory residue in the hippocampus region. See how they're bleeding into the blue? So what are we Rewriting looking at? Rewriting memories. They're planting new memories in their heads, modifying their personalities. Oh, this is big shit, Johnny. Fuck me. Got other guinea pigs besides the paralysis, too. Quick, download the data. Whoever comes looking for it, that's your suspect. Shit! They're wiping the data. We've been made. Did we download now it, they though? they know someone's been in their database. Wonder if they also know who. Hey. Uh. Oh, these things are back on again. V, do you have any news? Yes, we do. I'm gonna wanna sit down for this. It's... It's way bigger than we thought. What is? You're being brainwashed. Literally. They've scanned your minds and now using some kind of conditioning to... Wait, not on the hollow. Right, I'll come by. No, you and I, we need to speak alone. Wild, I know she doesn't want to place in Japan town. Sending you the coordinates. Right, see you there. Okay. Episode 26 is now done and dusted. We're going to pick up number 27 and we're going to head over to see what this is all about. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you so much for following on the journey. We will see you on the next episode.